Hi, my name is Chris Milliner with Strongbrook. I assist everyday people around the country and around the world to start preparing to invest in real estate. Today I want to talk a little bit about wealth. I have clients come to me every day wanting to increase their wealth but really having no idea of what it is or what it means to them. Wealth isn't dollars in your bank account. It isn't net worth. Wealth is simply put the ability to act. The ability to take your will and your ideas and bring them into form, into reality. So as people start building and acquiring wealth, their goal is to start reshaping their lives, their ambitions, their retirement for what they choose to do and choose to accomplish. And uh, my goal is to help facilitate that process, to help people really identify what their goals are and what kind of material support they'll need to bring those goals into fruition. Uh, most people's uh, financial decisions decrease their ability to act. Um, instead of becoming more free, they spend their resources that they have and tie themselves down. My goal is to help people realize and understand what types of purchases actually increase someone's ability to act. There are a few of these, um, but you've got to do them right and you've got to look at it correctly. Uh, when you make a proper investment, um, you're not just gaining money back, you're gaining freedom of motion. And eventually the goal is to help my clients gain the freedom to retire, to not have the same type of demands to go to work and earn a living to provide for themselves and their families. So as you're looking at building your own wealth, keep in mind when you're making purchases, is this going to be something that increases my ability to act or does it decrease my ability to act? And if you use this as a guide, it'll help you identify which purchases you'll make will truly lead yourself towards wealth and towards greater freedom and greater power to act and to shape the world as you wish it.